sounds of live music returning to one of Buffalo's biggest suburbs tonight. Stir crazy neighbors in Lancaster got outside to enjoy something they used to take for granted music. It's part of our Buffalo Strong lineup. Seven Eyewitness News reporter Adam Unger has more on this partial return to normalcy in these not so normal times. When was the last time you saw live music? It's probably been at least a few months. Live music, wow. Um, probably last winter. Well, the same goes for how long bands have gone without performing. Hit and Run got together in frontman Mark Valentino's driveway for a little more than just a tune-up. We haven't played for about two months. We do about 100 shows a year, and uh, a lot of our friends and fans have asked when we're playing or they're disappointed about shows getting canceled. And they rocked the house in Lancaster tonight with a two hour set for family, friends and neighbors. And the classic rock and pop hits were a welcome sense of normalcy. Right now, people need to feel a sense of love and this really helps everybody to feel good and to bring people together, which is what this world needs right now. I knew we were born to get together. Saturday wasn't exactly Hit and Run's first gig. Not only is it a chance to tune up as a group, but it's also a chance to give back to their neighborhood and to fans from all over the area. We've uh, been lucky enough to be able to be around for 30 years. So it's our way of giving something back to them because typically they've been telling me that they're going stir crazy at home doing nothing. So this gives them an opportunity to watch the band from home. Talk about seats in the lawn. Tonight, Chestnut Corner was the stage. In Lancaster, Adam Unger, 7 Eyewitness News.